Yeah, I don't know. You, Are you yell. You're unreasonable. Yeah, I don't. I won't scream at you. Beach. You. Yes. You. Okay, time for the latest installment of Change My Mind, where we rationalize our positions on controversial topics. Click the description to see previous installments. Now this week, we decided to take on the current media narrative in that President Trump is a racist. You know what? I don't buy it. How about you? Is Donald Trump a racist responsible for a rise in white supremacy? Comment below. Unfortunately, before we could even begin the conversation at our table, some folks were cocked and ready. Dude, I would love for you to sit you, down. You know what he said, right? Yeah. What did he say? What are you talking about? He said that we need to close our borders to illegal immigrants. Go home. Right? He was telling... Remember the chant, said, the chant at his rally? What was the chant he led at his rally? Go ahead, you tell me. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, go back home. Go back to the country you came from. And how is that racist? It's racist because you need to understand they are already home. Could, would you like me to explain to you? No, if you can't, if you can't honestly, you know what the chant I is. You know exactly well, you do, what that chant well, is. You don't. You don't. You just said you don't. <laughs> you just I, said you have no idea what the chant is. No, I do. Uh, it's basically, you just said he said go no, back go home. home. Go back home. I, it was something like that. Yeah. Okay. Had nothing to do with people being Eventually, minorities. Eventually, I'll recognize the actual quote, but it's just exactly no, you what, won't. what does. You'll never eventually no, recognize oh, the quote. Oh, no, I actually will. Go ahead. Like go ahead. Take all the, the time. Take all the time. The GOP, you know, they... they they talk to Mueller as if he's a child. The, the, there is no precedent for this. When, when, a, when a president is completely corrupt, completely owned by a hostile foreign uh, Putin, there's no precedent for that. It's an unwritten rule in America that you defend your country. That's what Mueller did. There was no exoneration. Will I be able to speak? Am I allowed to speak? You said I, I tapped uh, the light. No, no, apparently not. No, apparently you're not allowed to speak. Can I speak? Is that okay? Uh, no, it's not okay. So it, it's not okay for me to speak? I mean, not, so not if you're going to lie to my face and pretend, you know, if you pretend to not remember what that chant is, that Tell chant, me what the exact and words are. your audience seems to want to remember Tell me what it. the exact chants are. <laughs> Tell me what the exact chants are. Go back home. Go back home. That's the exact Go chant? Go back home. That's Go back chant. home. That's the exact chant? Go back home. That's the exact chant? Yeah, you're a damn backstabbing Trump supporter. A Lying ass, lying right to my face. The chant. I don't think you're a liar. You know you're wrong because you don't know the chant. You, know the you chant have no idea led. what you're talking about. The locker, locker up is evidence. Okay. He's so we've completely gone from, compromised we've by got, Putin. We've, we've gone from he wants he to said, become the United States of Putin. This isn't really what we do with change my mind. Anyone's welcome to sit down <laughs> my mind. and have a civil discussion. You know, the this only guy's way just they crazy. Change their mind is if they squat and dump. Come on, we're more than welcome to have this conversation That's if you know what you're talking about. Anytime, we you can just sit and go talk. back to the country you came from, white people. Anyone think President Donald Trump is a racist? We hear all day today, we've been hearing that regarding uh, the, the shooting Our that occurred in El Paso. Of Charlottesville. Yep. You know, if you, if you benefit from the KKK, you are a racist. You are a racist. What if you condemn the KKK? He never has, he never will. Our nation must condemn racism, bigotry, and white supremacy. When you open your heart to patriotism, there is no room for prejudice. Racism is evil, including the KKK, neo-Nazis, white supremacists, and other hate groups that are repugnant to everything we hold dear as Americans. Sure he did. Not out loud. Sure he did. Well, maybe it's Many times. Many times. By name. Yeah. How many contacts do you have to see before you realize Donald Trump is a Putin production? How about facts? Trump is a supporter. Many times they come up and say, Putin's not so bad. The point hey, of, how many the people point here support Donald Congress Trump to a degree? Okay. Now, by same show of hands, how many people here think Putin is a d <laughs> There you go. So and, maybe we can sit down and have really, common ground. It doesn't really say anything, man. Well, sure it does. You no, just said every Trump supporter. No, not at all. Everyone here, Trump fan, supporters, fan, not, not fans of Putin. And you Trump supporters cannot be trusted. They're lying. All of them are lying. I would love to sit down with you if you would like to talk. I doubt it. I really would. Yeah, there's nothing to talk about. Okay. At this point, there's nothing to talk about. Okay. I Listen. Anyone who agrees, disagrees, is welcome to sit down and have a conversation. Hopefully yeah. you can make a better case Never than the gentleman over there. I don't America think Donald Trump. Conquering your country. Donald American. Trump is not a racist. Donald Trump is a racist. Change my mind. Sir. Present Donald some Trump factual is information. A racist, and if you support Donald Trump, you are absolutely a racist. So all of you here are racist. I just want to make sure, including you, Miss Brown Lady. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>
You're a white, you. you're a white supremacist there if I ever saw one. Slavery, yeah, let's just sit down. We don't have to disagree. I'm just because you seemed pretty passionate in your responses here. Now he just said, and I, I was trying to reiterate to make sure that I understood him correctly. Sorry, but I think you all heard him say that if you support Donald Trump, you are a racist. Yeah. So you heard that, and you said that you do support Donald Trump to one degree or another. During the times of slavery. Why? And what do you make of what this man is saying? Uh, because they were, because you know, I agree with his immigration policy. Are, are uh, I'm not from America. I'm from the Netherlands. That's oh, okay. So, but in Europe, we have had open borders. Right. Nothing, and my parents came here. My mom came here to August. She worked. She, she didn't live on welfare. She always worked for her money. My father took two jobs. Right. So then we had open borders. We had people coming in here, living off child benefits. We My parents worked for those benefits. Of and and you, know, you know, you let people in from all cultures out there, and they don't assimilate. Yeah. We've had problems. So, so when you hear Do President Donald Trump say we need to secure our borders, we need to make sure that illegal immigrants. Are, you don't hear that as brown people. You hear that as illegal immigrants. And you agree? Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, that sounds entirely reasonable. And people out there, look, listen, I'm from Europe. We had terrorist attack after terrorist attack. You don't supporting lies. After France, that was war, but after Paris, after Manchester, so a terrorist can come in and blow up teenage girls at a pop concert. Right. Under the of right, that's normal. And how, Every how long have you been in the United States? Uh, I'm here on holiday. Oh, okay. But I've been here for night for the, the, the nine time. Okay. My parents are America lovers, so my parents came here when I was little. Well, we would love to have you if you can c c come out here. What do you do? Yeah. I'm a teacher, so I work. I work in the left wing. Yeah, you work in a very left wing. Uh, and we had a meeting a couple of weeks ago, and one of my colleagues didn't agree with me about Trump. We had a little bit of a fight. <laughs> one of the colleagues gave me a Hillary Clinton for President Mark to tease me. Oh, really? Uh, but I, as an immigrant, my, my parents are immigrants, I was born in the Netherlands. But right. I support strong borders. If you don't have strong borders, you don't have a country. Right. And Europeans are too weak. They are too comfortable. After World War II, you know, they are too comfortable. They don't protect the borders. They think everybody should come here. Why? Well, it could be because they're afraid of being accused of being racist, like you're seeing there. So. And in Europe, you, it, in Europe it's political correctness right. as a continent. So. Okay. Well, there you have it. A, a Trump supporter from the Netherlands uh, who doesn't believe herself to support the KKK as far as I understand so uh, we just want to make sure we clarify that I didn't want people to see you and be like does she support the KKK you know they could do that you know you don't know what's on under those robes so I understand that now well thank you very much for sitting down. I appreciate it I'm sorry that you couldn't be more productive we have to move locations so anyone who just wants to yell and accuse people of being a racist stay here anyone who wants to sit down and have a disagreement of opinions we're gonna go over here and everyone is welcome and I, I don't know if you guys see this, and this is something that we deal with a lot, and I want you all to be aware of it when you watch the media. There's a big difference between arguing facts, and by the way, there can be facts that present both sides of the argument. I understand that. Sometimes you'll show up and someone will present a really compelling argument from the left. That being said, there's a big difference between arguing facts or even presenting your opinion and immediately attributing a motive to your opposition. Right? That's what happens when you say your opposition, you've all been accused of being racist. You've all been accused of uh, being Putin supporters. You've all been accused of supporting the KKK. That shits down the discussion before it begins. And that's something that we try not to do. So I appreciate that everyone is here, that everyone's been civil. We haven't had anyone who disagrees willing to sit down yet, but, you know, listen, I want to do it in good faith. Luckily, after we moved our table and had some distance between us and Bruce, people who disagreed were willing to sit down, and we had some pretty productive conversations. I think he tried to take the, uh, the, the free phone away, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That doesn't mean he's a racist. That is racist. People are arrested in Germany, jailed for speech. No! No! Yes. They're arrested. They're arrested if they use hateful speech. Because of course they are. Okay, f*** off. So you want Nazis? You You guys started it. More of those conversations next Tuesday. Don't forget to support us by joining up at Mug Club for $99 annually, $69 for students, veterans, active military at louderwithcrowder.com. It's the only way to keep these videos going, as well as access the full daily show and entire Blaze catalog. Now finally, realizing he was no longer the center of attention, this crazy leftist decided that he wanted to sit down. You want to sit down and talk? Sure. What do you, what do you think? I don't, know. I don't know if he's reasonable. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, I don't know. You, you were yelling. Yeah, I don't. I'm going to scream at you. I obliged with some very clear conditions. All right, the only thing is you have to promise that when we're done, we're done. And you leave. 
They can't just sit here and not let anyone else sit down. Oh, no, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> no, I get up no matter okay. what. It, right. Yeah, right. Hey, you're not going to throw me up. I'll get up when it's cool. time to go. Whatever. They can't just sit here and not let anyone else sit down. Oh, no, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> no, I get up no matter what. It, yeah, right. Right. you're not going to throw me up. I'll get up when it's time to go. Whatever it takes. <laughs> yeah, are you really seriously? I don't think so. Have fun with it. Fun, fun crowd. It is you know, a fun crowd. It's been a great crowd. Good supporters. What's your name? Bruce or Jesus Christ, depending on on your uh, uh, ability to recognize yourself in the mirror. Okay, I'll go with Bruce. So, Bruce, no, it's actually Jesus Christ. You'll go with Jesus Christ. I'll go with Bruce. Okay. So, Bruce, I don't believe that President Donald Trump oh, is God. Uh, a racist. The reason, the reason can you I, should go with Jesus finish? Christ is because I'm right here in front of you, mm -hmm. and I, you can actually learn something from helping to save our country and saving the world. Okay. We have to get all minds on, uh, you know, all hands on deck, all minds on point. Protect the truth. Jesus Christ. Uh, exactly. That's that's how that's the correct way to pronounce my name. Jesus Christ is the correct way to pronounce my name. You stumbled upon it. There you go. I see I'm, you I'm serious about sure. that. Okay, I don't believe that uh, President I'm Donald you, Trump... you're me. There's only one me in all reality. Yeah. It's a, uh, okay, we'll go Seriously, back. Seriously, the, there we'll, is. We'll go back to the Jesus Christ thing. Uh, but I, this is the reason we're here. We have the sign. I, I, you know, listen, yeah. I don't buy it that Donald Trump's a racist. Why? So you were yelling earlier, why, pretty upset. Why? Because he, he might not get he might not get elected if people well, believe he's a racist. That's why you don't no, like it. No, that's not why. I don't believe that he's a racist. It, so again, it, it if feels you sit uncomfortable, down, you know, to feel like you're a racist because you support Donald Trump. If you if you sit down, is that why? If you sit down. The onus is on you to change my mind. That's the whole idea. Uh, so yeah, you rationalize I, part your mind. Yeah. Part of changing your mind is 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 revealing your motives. As well, no, why, you don't know my motives. Why you don't want to see Trump as a racist. You, you have motives. And yeah, you do. You definitely have motives. You want to get Trump elected, right? You're a Trump supporter. You want to see him get elected. You don't want people to think he's a racist. And because if they think Trump's a racist and you're a, you're a Trump supporter, they're going to see you as a racist and you, you don't like how that feels so you're motivated to convince people trump's not a racist whether he's a racist or not you couldn't give a crap but you want to convince everyone he's not a racist yeah you, so he gets elected so everything you've just said is incorrect uh, no it's exactly correct well, exactly no, accurate everything you've just said is incorrect no and it's exactly and correct the, it's exactly accurate and it's in the realm of something that couldn't let's assume you were what correct what you're saying you is incorrect not you said you were going to sit down. And you're I going did. To be civil. You're I, I'm down, so I am. You have to I let am. Finish speaking. But you can't call something I say incorrect sure when I it's can. actually correct. Sure, I can call it incorrect. Well, I'm and, explain and, to you why it's and incorrect. And I can say your your statement of saying it was incorrect was incorrect. Okay. But anyway, go ahead. You're a racist. You're a racist. You're a tried okay. and true racist. How am I a racist? I think you're a racist. Uh, okay. The how? fact that you made this your raison d'être. How? I think you're a racist. I think you're anti-Jewish by insulting uh, uh, people of the Jewish ethnicity, claiming that you are Jesus Christ. No. I think you're a racist. Insult anybody. Prove to me you're not a racist. Okay, I will. Prove to me you're not a racist. I will. <laughs> there is no proof. You, you you can't prove you're not a you're, racist. You're a racist. You can prove yourself a racist, though. Oh, okay. You can't, if, but if, I'm saying your if, motive is if, that you're a racist. If you, you're sitting if you down brown, because you are racist. If you racist. put brown people in cages to be ever seen by pedophiles, uh, you're a racist. Yeah. If, if, you, if you stand up and say, I'm Jesus Christ, I am you, you are me, there's only one me in all of reality, uh, let's have the back of life itself and not go extinct, uh, that doesn't make you a racist. No, It doesn't make you a, a hater of Jews. It makes you a person saying, hey, I am you, you are me, there's no. only one me in all of reality. No, you're a racist. Let's have the back of life itself. You're let's racist. save life from yeah. going extinct. Honesty and truth before the lies of pride. Yeah. That matters. You should be more honest about your racism. I am honest about who I am. You should be more honest I, about your racism. I understand the racist that you are. Well, I understand you know, the racist that you I are. I think you're a racist. You are a complete racist. You're a racist. Inside your head, I can you're see you. You're a racist. You are a racist. I am rubber, you are you glue, are sir. Bounces you're a racist. 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 You're a You're a racist. 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 You're a racist.
Christ! Eat my butt! <laughs> this, of course, comes from the Proverbs. And Jesus Christ, in his anguish, cried out <laughs> that his detractors should lick his swollen butthole. I want to press charges to the full extent of the law. I don't think Jesus is going to like the way this one ends up. For your viewing pleasure, here are the police officers, upon reviewing the footage, notifying Bruce Christ that should he press charges, he would find himself immediately in jail as well. Let him go. Let him go. It's telling me more about you guys than, than anything else. You're destroying credibility of the most important law enforcement officers we've got. But let him go. Let him go. He politely declined. It's my word against I get arrested if he gets arrested. Bullshit. Bullshit. Now, it would be easy to just say that Bruce Christ is a crazy person, and he is, but where, oh where, have I heard these exact same arguments before? Well, Jesus Christ, of course he's racist. Yes. He's basically threatening us with going full racist. Suggesting that the entire Trump vote was racist and by racists? I, I, I think, I think, yes. Do you believe President Trump is a racist? Yeah. No question. Look at what he's done. It's racist. That statement of Trump's is old school racism. It doesn't make you not racist. It actually makes you racist. If you support somebody who does racist things, that makes you racist. So Present Donald some Trump factual is information. Racist, and if you support Donald Trump, you are absolutely a racist. This president is encouraging greater racism. They are softening the ground for straight up racism out of the president's Twitter account. He's launching a blatantly racist attack on four duly elected members of the United States of House of Representatives. His own words and actions are racist too. There has never been a president in American history who's been as so openly racist and divisive. He's racist and no black people can't be racist. This is not the first nor will it be the last time we hear disgusting bigoted language from the president. Down because brown, you are if you racist. If you put brown people in cages to be ever seen by pedophiles, uh, you're racist.